Hey guys, this is Sunshine from HairLiciousInc.com and HairLisa.com with a product review video. Today I'll be reviewing and somewhat comparing two of my favorite products that I've used on a weekly basis, if not every other day, and that would be the uh, Organic Root Stimulator Olive Oil Edge Control and the Cream of Nature Argan Oil Perfect Edges. Okay, so with the Edge Control, it has a nice fruity scent, so when you apply this to your hair, it smells like you just shampooed your hair, which is obviously a bonus. Uh, it's very thick, like a clear jelly-like consistency, and I'll show you guys how stiff that is. Yeah, and when you apply it to your edges, you immediately feel that superior hold, as it says on the jar, like I'm not lying to you guys, the hold is really tight. And it's a good thing, especially if you're stretching. Um, if you want that slick, clean look, if you have natural hair and you have a certain style that you're trying to go for, if you're, even if you're transitioning, this is really good. Uh, the only downfall with this is that if you have product laden hair or if you have any kind of other or any other product in your hair at the time, chances are you'll experience like a white residue. And I've gotten a lot of complaints about that because um, I did a formal review on my blog hairliciousink.com and some have complained that okay they have this white residue in their hair or f or they have some kind of flakes of some sort um, my suggestion to you is to not apply it to um, your hair if there's any other products in it make sure you apply it to clean freshly shampooed and conditioned hair and chances are you won't experience the the residue and I usually tend to pull this out when I'm about anywhere from six to eight weeks post relaxer and it does an amazing job with the cream of nature argan oil perfect edges I use this usually uh, when I'm about four to s zero to four weeks post relaxer and I'll show you guys what it looks like it has a nice yellowish orange tint to it and I'm guessing because it's primarily made of argan oil and argan oil tends to have like that orange dark tint to it and this is what it looks like very thick as well similar to the edge control it's much smoother um, when you're trying to scoop it out the jar and when applying it to your hair as well not much of a tight grip I find that if you were to apply this in the morning by let's say middle of the day not even let's say around 4 or 5 p.m. usually when I get home the hold is is it no longer exists <laughs> so that's one of the downfalls with the uh, perfect edges but I love it because I always get compliments on the shine the shine is like out of this world and it says here uh, perfect hold exotic shine makes hair stronger and I can honestly vouch for the shine it's like amazing so um, this product is very moisturizing as well I think it's because of the argan oil but um, I'm not entirely sure because there are no ingredients on the back, so I will do a formal written review on hairliciousink.com if you guys are interested. And uh, another thing with this, there's no residue, none whatsoever. So that's kind of the difference between the two. So uh, this one now is more so uh, best to use if you have coarser, um, coarser hair and if you're stretching or if you have natural hair, if you are transitioning perfect uh, the only thing is it, it, you can have residue with this one uh, this one now is much more moisturizing no residue and it's um, amazing shine so that is the comparison between the two uh, they both do the same thing it just all depends on what you're looking for and I hope that was informative and I'll see you guys in the next video